hey guys welcome to this video it's blake and today i'm gonna be vlogging um and you know taking y'all with me so i just um put my hair up i was gonna i wanted to do like a slick back with no part i've never done that before but it wasn't working i was a little lazy i didn't feel like doing all the sections so it was kind of puffy and then i was like i don't think i look good with no part so it just came up but i'm not doing anything special today so i'm about to put on some makeup just because um i bought some things from target last week like i kind of went a little overboard um so i have some returns like some stuff i just didn't like i need to cook oh my gosh i need to cook okay so i don't know I just recently like got put onto this restaurant called Qdoba and I've been obsessed with it like obsessed like last week I think I had it like the last two weeks I've had it m the majority of the week and I'm like this is so bad like I feel so bad like eating out like but it's only ten dollars my mom said that wasn't bad but like I just don't eat out <laughs> so I just need to cook so I bought like all this stuff to make what I eat there at home so I need to make that for the week or at least today like come on but i'm just like so lazy to cook these days i'm not sure why i'm just kind of tired last week was a little rough because ugh, i just had so much work so i was trying to relax today but i don't know how to relax anymore these days i'm kind of like a addicted to work or like a workaholic like i don't think i work too much but i just like i'm obsessed with working so or everything that I love to do has turned into my work so now I don't know what to do to not work if that makes sense like in my free time oh, uh, no you have the wrong number anyways what was I saying I don't even know what I was thinking coming out on Saturday. And it's so busy everywhere. I <laughs> now I'm getting like all frustrated. I was at the Starbucks line and the Starbucks that is closest is kind of has like this weird drive through thing. And I was in line and then the person in front of me decided not to get in line anymore So then the person on the other side decided to skip me and then the person behind me decided to go around me and try and skip me And I just wasn't understanding what was going on and it's like people think that like they act like you're not sitting right there in your car Like I can see you so I'm at Target now, but I'm just going to return what I need to and then pick up the little things that I needed I am NOT shopping today. I don't feel like it. I'm ready to go back home Yeah, it was closer to the beginning of this week. Um, well, actually, all throughout the week. <laughs> this weekend, I got to like relax, and so it was a little bit better. But it was more so like I can't really describe. Like, hold on, I think I wrote it down. If it happened this way, I'm like. And I wouldn't think too much about it, but I would be like, oh, you know, maybe it is about to come. And I would just kind of like shrug it off to that without really taking out like what actual day it is and how long it really had been. Hi. Happy Monday. What's going on? I'm getting ready. I'm about to go to the mall with my mom. And I just finished my hair. About to eat breakfast. There's the microwave. Um... 
Okay, so yeah, I straightened my hair, so I'm just letting it sit for a minute. I'm so excited. I don't know if I want to curl it though. I kind of feel like I should, but we'll see because we'll see if I want to wear it straight. But I'm gonna put on a little bit of makeup. Eat breakfast, and then we're gonna go to the mall. Hey guys, just out. Oh. I always hit my foot on this bed, but um, it's just been kind of like a chill day, which I like to do my Mondays because I'm just gonna do some beading tonight. I'm so excited. I wanna like add some beading so I can have them with like to add to my like gold jewelry. I had gotten to beading like over the summer and I was making like waist beads just for myself for fun. And I was like spending all my money on beads. And it just reminded me of like, it brought me back to when I, I was younger. Cause I used to wear like only bracelets. Like I didn't have my ears pierced. I didn't wear necklaces. Just wore like a whole bunch of bracelets. Like the little like friendship bracelets, the pony bead bracelets, silly bands. Like I wore those, I loved bracelets. So it just brought me back. So I wanna make some like bracelets, some necklaces. Hey y'all, it's Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. I'm just getting ready. Um, I'm filming like a week in my hair video. I straightened my hair with Aussie products this time. I still use like my new normal like um, heat protectant and like serum stuff. I Not heat protectant because I use their heat protectant but um, like serum blow dry stuff. But I used all their products. Shampoo, conditioner, deep conditioner, leave-in, heat protectant. And it worked out so good. Because the last time I straightened my hair for my birthday, I know I didn't. If you saw that video, <laughs> it did not turn out good. So... Um, their products did really well for my hair and I think it looks good but I am going to film a makeup video today so I'm about to do that in a second I think I want to trying to figure out if I wanted to do like my edges or something also how do we feel about the color I think it looks really good it's faded now it's not it's not like red anymore how do you wear a side part like I guess you have to have a bang to do a side part like it just feels so weird to do a side part although someone commented and said that they liked like I looked best with the, the side part but I don't know maybe it was because my when my hair is like natural in its natural state but I'm just really love the middle part yeah, I'm gonna do my makeup today. I might, I kind of like my hair is inspiring me. I want like a fall picture in front of like leaves and stuff. <laughs> I think it'd look really good with my hair. But um, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and get ready. But I'm gonna film it so I can't show it in the vlog. Hey, brief interruption. I just wanted to take a moment to talk about this video's sponsor, which is Skillshare. I'm so excited about this. So this portion of the video is sponsored by Skillshare. I'm so excited to be working with Skillshare. I've been very interested in the platform for a while now. I actually wanted to buy myself a subscription for my birthday, but I never got around to it. But that's okay because now they're giving me a chance to share it with you guys. So let me tell y'all a little bit more about it. So to put it simply, Skillshare is an online learning community for creative and curious people. Skillshare offers 
thousands of classes in different fields like design, illustration, video, photography. I don't know about y'all, but that sounds like me in a bottle. Like Skillshare just encompasses everything that I really love to do. So that's why I'm so excited. I am passionate about my creative career and Skillshare is a place where I can go to pursue that and help further me along in different areas. And I'm just really glad that there's something like Skillshare for people like me. Skillshare is for all levels. They offer video classes with projects and a community that can give you feedback. I'm currently taking a class called Create Your Dream Career, Uncover and Apply Your Creative Strengths, taught by Holly M. Coley Murchison. Skillshare members get unlimited access to thousands of classes, for just about $10 a month when you sign up for the annual subscription and just a little bit more than that if you do the monthly subscription. And to top it off, the first 1,000 people to use the link in my description will get a free trial of Skillshare Premium. So again, thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring this part of the video and let's get back to it. Hey y'all, have I said anything today? I don't think so, but Oops. Okay, I'm taking out this trash card. Just finished filming my everyday makeup or my go-to makeup routine. Um, so yeah, that'll be up. I'm uploading this tomorrow, so y'all will have already seen it. Uh, but it turned out good. My makeup looks good, so. Also, my mom helped me trim my hair a little bit better. I did when I did it, but it just wasn't it. So she, like, we didn't even take much off, but like, it just feels so much better, so. I was like, I was constantly like, I think I just need to get a haircut because I just don't know. And I was gonna like curl it to kind of hide that, but I just need to trim a little bit more. That video went by really fast. Um, so I kind of feel like editing it right now because I'm gonna see what it looks like. Actually, I might do that. I feel like I would be an official YouTuber if I just filmed a video and then sat right down and edit. I've never done that before. But first, let me check my to-do list off. Last night, I said I was going to um, do beading, but I was so tired. But I'm going to do some today. Hopefully, if I finish my work early enough. Yesterday, I've been wanting to do, like, these beads for a minute. Like, over the summer, I was kind of more focused on the waist beads. So, I didn't make any, like, bracelets or necklaces. But I've been seeing, like, you mix, like, the fun, colorful beads in with, like, your jewelry and i just love how it looks and it's being more popular now because now like urban outfitters free people anthropology nordstrom like they're all selling these like you can do it yourself type bracelets and stuff so i'm gonna make some today but i just i've like i have let me show you hold on <laughs> this is all the stuff that i've collected recently like i already had some stuff but so i got these from like beading stores Oh, I also got this tattoo marker. I was like, oh my gosh. All the days I used to write on myself in high school, like where was something like this? And I tested it out last night and it's gone now. So it doesn't last too long, but it was cool. So I wanna do something with that. Um, I went to Joanne's had like a sale. Everything was like $2.99. So I got some charms. Oh, I just wanna make something. I got some like letter beads. Um, I got all these like crystals and stuff and, from a beading store. Like lots of charms. Because originally I was going to like have a look, start like a Etsy shop or something. Like just like make little cute jewelry. Um, but after I put all my focus into the nail stuff, I was like, I think I kind of want to just focus on that. So I have these two beads. These are from like Michaels and Joann's and Hobby Lobby. Um, I have some more freshwater pearls and stuff. Some more CDs and then I have some like letter beads, number beads, pony beads. So um, definitely want to make that. But like I have all this stuff because I was going to do a business, right? But now I I don't know. Like I don't know. I kind of want to, but I don't, I don't know if I just, I don't want to do everything anymore. Like I'm just realizing it's just not possible to do everything. But... I'm thinking like I'll make some and maybe give them away to like friends, family, like, or I can make some and then just make like a Depop shop or something. I don't know. We'll see. 
Okay, I'm gonna go take some selfies and stuff so I have something for the video. And then we're gonna cook, yay! Seasonings. All the stuff. We're gonna make the meat, the rice, and the vegetables. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can do that together, honestly. They put the corn. It's just now 6 o'clock and it feels like it's like 10. I'm like, I'm tired. These are my blue light glasses from Francesca's. I need to, um, I need to call, uh... Wednesday. <laughs> I'm getting ready. I'm about to film a get ready with me. So this video, this get ready with me, it has a sponsor. So I'm kind of excited about it. It's a fragrance. And it's these. I've seen these around. Um sometimes I hadn't I've seen other people use these. Why is we got me? Okay. Um but yeah, it's Dossier, I think is how you say it. So I just have two fragrances that I'm going to be talking about. Spicy Vanilla and uh, Gourmand Orange Blossom. And I picked so good. They smell... Why are we having a hard time focusing? Okay. They smell so good. Like, I'm wearing the Spicy Vanilla one right now. I wore um, the Orange Blossom one the last few days. And wow. <laughs> I love them so much. I have been getting more into fragrances like since my birthday. I also like these that I got from Sephora, the Dolce Gabbana, the only one, and then um, the Nest Citrine. These, they all just smell so good. I'm gonna be filming that in a second. I just wanted to paint my nails. <sighs> I haven't been doing my nails just cause I've been like working a lot and long nails just make you go slow. Um, so I wanted to paint my nails and then, oh, upload the video for today. It's the makeup tutorial that I filmed yesterday. I edited, edited it, edited it, edited it last night. So I'm just gonna um, export it. I can't decide if I wanna add some music to it or not, or if I just kinda want it to be quiet. I think I'm gonna add music, cause that's what I do. But this is my setup for the video. 
I think it'll be kind of cute. Anything that be happening, people do not want to associate it with COVID. They'll be like, oh, it's cause the weather changed or oh. All right, my video's going up at like five today. It's a makeup routine. I'm a little iffy on the thumbnail. Um, so I don't know, I hope y'all like it. <laughs> but it would definitely have already been up, so. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do, oh, and I painted my nails, did a little something, cause it's just so not me to have no painted nails, but I don't want any length. I just wanna wear my natural nails, like I can't, I'm kind of not, I'm not in a long nail kind of mood these days. These days, I've been saying that a lot. Um, but I still really like my nails done, so I just went ahead and painted them regular. I did pretty good, I haven't used regular nail polish in, in years, like this is, I don't know middle school or something okay so then i'm gonna do my bracelet i'm gonna do my bracelet that i made last night i think i'm gonna change it because it's a little big so i don't know why i thought it was like i needed 10 inches but i did 10 inches i think i need only eight i'm gonna change it to create instead of creative because it's like i'm creative but create is more like a statement you know So it's about that time. This vlog has come to an end. And again, I've worn this shirt like three times in this video. Oh my gosh. You know, I actually did go to Urban when I went to the mall and looked at more of these. Like I'm going to get more because obviously it's a staple and I'm not gonna fight it. Like, yeah, I love wearing it and I don't wanna stop. So I'm just gonna get some like more. <laughs> Cause this is, I can't, like, okay, you can wear the same shirt. Like I can wear the same shirt for three times in a week, but not every week. Then I'm just wearing the same shirt every day of my life, which I might as well just get rid of all of my clothes and just buy these. And then that's all I have. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed another vlog. I've been enjoying making them and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.